in Philadelphia built a pulley system outside the store that lifts shopping carts and dips them into giant tubs of liquid sanitizer to ensure that they are not spreading the coronavirus. Boo coronavirus! To customers. As you can see in this video, even the Goyim are learning what it's like to clean for Pesach. Very well said, Toby. For most birds, nest building means putting together a bunch of twigs and dry leaves. Mm -hmm. However, don't tell that to the tailor bird. These tiny birds in tropical places worldwide go through extraordinary extraordinary lengths to sew together a comfortable and safe home for their families. The nest construction is a team effort. The females do the stitching and the males fetch the material. The birds want to make sure that the nests and eggs are camouflaged from predators. <laughs> Same 
words just as you go. Or start with the middle word and work your way to the beginning and the end using the same words on each side. Have your parents email us your palindromes. We'd love to see them. Our email address is elishwimmer1 at gmail.com. And now for my favorite part, trivia. For today's entertainment section, we will do a riddle and some piece of trivia. We will post the answers on the next episode. If you know all the answers, have your parents email them to the email address posted here. Make sure to include your name and address and you will go to a raffle for a really cool prize. We haven't decided what the prize will be, but it will be really awesome. Here's the riddle. You have a cup that holds five ounces. And you have another cup that holds three ounces. There are no other markings on these cups and to your luck, your mother asks you for exactly four ounces of water. What should you do? Stay tuned. And finally, Pesach trivia. How many days is Chalamo? There are six things on the card. Name them. Do you know the Yom Tov Pesach has three other names? How many can you use? Can you list? What is the day after Pesach called? That's all folks! See you next time!